In this video, I'll show you how to create this pixel shadow effect in Adobe Illustrator. Stay tuned to find out. Studio Shepherd. So my illustration is ready for me to add some shadows. There are lots of different ways to do this, but I'm going to use the pen tool and choose a color that stands out from my image. And then I'm simply going to draw in where I want my shadows to go. Once you're finished drawing your shadows, with all your shadows selected, open the gradient menu, click on the gradient bar to apply it, and make sure it's set to black and white. Now select the gradient tool from the left menu, and one by one, click and drag to adjust the direction we want our shadows to go. When you're done, with all your shadows selected, go up to Object, Rasterize, Change the color mode to bitmap and the resolution to other. I'm going to choose 10 ppi, but you can adjust this to how big or small you want your pixels to be. Click OK. Now again, go back up to Object, Rasterize. This time, change the color mode to grayscale and the resolution to 300 ppi. Click OK. In the top menu, select Image Trace and click OK to this pop-up. Now open the image trace menu and under the advanced drop down, select ignore color and make sure it's set to white. Close this and now click expand. Finally, under transparency, set the blend mode to multiply and drop the opacity down to around 60%. And that's how to create a pixel shadow effect in Illustrator. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to stay up to date with the latest design tips. I'll see you in the next video.